This is Joseph Drust, and welcome back to another episode of Ask ZBrush. So we had a question sent in asking, how can I export multiple subtools to a single OBJ file? So to start off, I just have ZBrush loaded up, and I have the Demo Soldier model here loaded in. Now the Demo Soldier currently consists of 11 subtools, and the question is asking about how to export out a single file for the Demo Soldier here. So currently he has these 11 subtools and I want to take all these subtools and export out to one single OBJ file. So how can I go by doing that inside of ZBrush? So here are two options you can use to achieve the workflow you're looking for. So the first thing you can do is if you navigate to the tool palette and then go to the subtool area here, you can open up this merge area here and you can choose this merge visible option. So what this is going to do, it's going to look at all the subtools in your scene here that are visible, and then it's going to merge them together and create a new tool out of all of them. So by clicking the Merge Visible option here, you'll see at the top that I now have a new tool created. And if I click on that tool there, you can see now I have a version of the Demo Soldier here with all those subtools condensed to one single subtool. So now if I want to export this out as an OBJ, I can just come to the tool palette up here, and click export. Now I can just take this model here and now save this out as an OBJ. So now I have successfully exported out the demo soldier with all his subtools condensed into one tool. Now another option you can do is if I go back to the demo soldier here with the 11 subtools, is you can navigate up here to the Z plugin tab and open this up. And then you can open up the 3D print hub here. And then we're just gonna do a quick update size ratio. So just click this button. I'm going to choose the inch option here, and I'm going to go back to the plugin tab, and now I'm going to go to the export options area, open this up. In here, there is a toggle here for exporting to separate files, so I can turn that off. And then under what to export, I'm just going to make sure all is on. And now I'm going to click export to OBJ. So it's going to look at all the subtools in my scene here, and now generate a single OBJ file from them. Now if I save this, I now have that version of the mesh exported. So now if I import these back in by selecting say PolyMesh 3D Star and then clicking Import, I can pick one of these two exported versions of the Demo Soldier here. So if I click Demo Soldier 2, you're going to see that now I have a version of that model that was exported out to a single OBJ file. So the options again are either to go to the Subtool Palette and go to the Merge area and do a Merge Visible then export out that merged version of your model. Or with the version of the model here selected with multiple subtools, you can go to the Z plugin tab, locate the 3D print hub, and then under the export option here, just turn off the export to separate files. And then now when you export as an OBJ from here, it'll export out a single OBJ file that consists of all the subtools on your model. If you have any other questions related to ZBrush pipelines or processes, please use the hashtag AskZBrush on Twitter. Happy ZBrushing.